I am the iconic fashion figure. And I know most of you are probably wondering why. Why is she calling herself that? But the more you watch my videos, the more you'll see exactly why I am the icon. Now this is probably your first time seeing me on YouTube. This is actually the second video I've recorded. I had another one that was supposed to go up before this. But then I realized Halloween is next week. And if you're planning on going to any parties, you're most likely going this weekend. So, like, I'm late on this video. And I was thinking to myself, like, I'm tripping. I should have been had this uploaded. But what I'm going to go ahead and do, since Halloween is my favorite holiday and I wanted to do something for Halloween, I'm going to just show you some last-minute Halloween costumes since I'm last-minute uploading this video. And most of us probably on CP time anyway. Now, like I said, these costumes are last minute, so half of them, probably majority of them, I don't even know what I am. I just threw something together, and it looked like some Halloween type of costume, so we're going to call it a Halloween costume. But we're going to play a little game, and I need y'all to help me figure out exactly what I am, because I have no clue. So you can go ahead and drop your comments, let me know what you think I am, whoever got the best one wins. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and go in my closet, start pulling some stuff together, I'm show you guys exactly what I pulled together and then we're gonna hit these parties. Let's go. First costume I have. Not exactly sure what I'm supposed to be. Here. I low key look like a bumblebee. I should just put on some black wings. But it's cute and it's extra, something you can do for Halloween. Just some bougie costume. You can go in and can't nobody say nothing about you wearing it because it's Halloween. It's just the sequin bustier that I got off Amazon. I know it's last minute, but Amazon has two-day prime, so you order it today. You'll get it before Halloween or at least before this weekend for all the parties. Throw in a black skirt, some fur, and some hoop earrings. Next costume is a simple cat costume. I just put on this little tool skirt that I got, I think out of Target in the little girls section. Put in a black long sleeve t-shirt and a firm vest. And then the ears I got from Five Below. They were only $3. I thought they were so cute. They're in a rose gold. I think they came in regular gold too and the silver, but I got the rose gold. Something quick and simple to throw on and really cute. Next costume, and it looks cute. I don't know if I'm supposed to be like a teacher, librarian, maybe a student, probably the best thing to say. Looking in the mirror right now. But it's cute. All I did was put on, messing up my rug, um, just put on a brown circle skirt, a button up top, suspenders. You can get these from Walmart, Target, Marshalls, wherever. They're usually in the men's section. Sometimes you can find them in boys too. And just put on some cute heels. Had these shoes probably like four or five years. I have yet to wear them. And they're actually cute. I like the felt it. Can't you just tell I love to look at myself and I love to pose? So I'm back with the same costume because I just want to put these glasses on, trying different stuff. And this actually looks cute too. I'm definitely going to wear this just this year to like one of these basic parties because I'll stand out compared to all the basic bitches. I really don't know where I'm going with this one yet. I'm trying to figure out what I am, what I could do with it. But this is so sexy. I know people that don't see me every day are probably like, where she thinks she going? But I don't care. This is cute. If I can figure out what. I promise you I got on nipple covers. Well, actually, they just band-aids with some makeup over it. But this is last minute, right? Damn. But what I can do with it, maybe get devil ears or something? I don't know yet. I'm trying to figure it out. But I think I'm getting somewhere with this one. So this is 
definitely it. I like this a lot better. I got rid of the socks and turned it into a ninja. I kept the tight sewn for the black bodysuit. I had some rough fabric tied around my legs. Tied this around as, as a belt so I can put my sword in if I have one or if I can find one at a store. And black fabric for the mask. Now I'm a ninja. After that last costume I just had on, I felt like I needed to take it back to my sweet, innocent self and do an angel costume. Just put on all white, do white skirt, white t-shirt, angel wings in the halo you can get from like a party city. Walmart has them, Target has them, I'm sure everywhere has them because everyone wants to be an angel every year. I've had this for a few years because I was a Victoria's Secret angel before which wasn't so sweet. But we can take it back to the sweet side of me because I am an innocent girl. Now I know most of my costumes have been with circle skirts, but I have some with a tighter fitted skirt. You can even do white jeans if you want to be comfortable, but I'll show you with a tighter fitted skirt to see what this same exact costume would look like. Hopefully you can see the halo. I don't know if I'm getting cut out or not. Okay, here's what the fitted skirt, now not the circle skirt. Still same idea, white bottom, white t-shirt, wings, and your halo. And then I did take my hair down too because I thought it was cuter. Another costume, and I honestly don't know what I am. Maybe y'all can help me out to figure out what this is. Let me know what I look like or what I could be. All I did was put on this piece of fabric that I had laying around because I do sew. So I have a bunch of fabric everywhere. So I had this printed fabric, tied it around like it was a two top, knotted it in the front. This is actually a dress on the bottom. It's not even a skirt. I'm infamous for turning something in from nothing to something. Like I'll take anything. It could be a skirt and it'll become a top. A dress becomes a skirt. I don't care, whatever. I'm gonna make it work. Like I said, this is a last minute Halloween costume thing. So we gotta do what we can and use what we got to make it work. So I literally just tucked in the top of the dress. I actually bought this dress from H&M like a year ago. And when I bought it, I was going out that night. So I grabbed it last minute thinking it was something I can just throw on and go out. But it ended up looking so cheap. So I didn't end up wearing it at all because the dress just looked too cheap to me. But it actually doesn't look bad as a skirt now. So I wear this as a skirt tied this top super tight I can barely even breathe but I look cute so I don't care just help me figure out what I am there's another way that you can wear this too so I'm going to show you the other way that you can put this together another way to wear that same costume I just made the skirt a little longer and then I tied the top around to the back so crisscross in the front. I think I might like it the first way more for my body type, but if you're not a part of the itty bitty titty committee, you could probably get away with this style a little better. And if you don't have fabric, you can go to Joann's or like a Michael's and get fabrics like this, or even go to a regular clothing store and buy a printed scarf and you can do the same thing. Of course I had to do something with Minnie Mouse. But I did it real simple, real basic. I've actually... Sorry you can't really see the ears, but I'm not about to record that all over again. So you're going to have to imagine the Minnie Mouse ears. Worn a Minnie Mouse costume a few years ago. I'll put a picture somewhere on the screen so you can see the costume. I, that actually was a quick costume too that I made like the night before the party. So that's something easy that you could do too. Or you can just throw on a red dress and throw on the ears. The ears, all I did was I bought a headband from the dollar store, I think, or maybe even out of Walmart. Get some felt paper that you can get out of Michael's or Joann's. I think I got mine from Michael's, though. Cut out the little circles for the ears, and then I got this red fabric, the red polka dot fabric from Joann's. And I just glued this all down to the headband until it looked like an ears with the red bow. And this dress is actually a longer dress that I 
hiked up to make sure to look more like a party dress. And you can also throw on like a black top. So I think Minnie Mouse is black on the top, red on the bottom or something like that. To just do something simple like this. Or if you want to wear a longer dress, you can bring this down. Okay, last costume that I just randomly put together. Um, I don't know what I am again. Maybe some kind of superhero. Let me come save you. I don't know. But it's cute and it looks like it fits Halloween. I had this headband from another costume. I want to say it was probably like an Indian costume. So you can just call me an Indian superhero. Who cares? But if you don't have this, you can just get a regular headband and put a gym on the front of it. And I just put on some metallic shorts. You can do any shorts, black shorts, blue shorts, don't matter. Put on a black t-shirt, throw it together. Just make sure it all coordinates. That's all that matters. And then I put on this red cape, which is actually a red tube dress that I made out of some leftover fabric that I had. So this is really a dress. It's not even a cape, but I just pinned it around my neck to make it look like a cape. And I got myself an outfit or I got myself a costume. So those are all the costumes I have for y'all. Like I said, I didn't know what most of them were. So I'm gonna need y'all to help me figure it out. Let me know which costume you thought I looked like what. Like whatever you think it is, comment below. Let me know, help me out. So I don't go out looking crazy. Cause I don't even know where I am. Maybe it don't even look like a Halloween costume like I thought. Now since this is your first time on my channel watching one of my videos, I already know you haven't subscribed. So make sure you hit the subscribe button down below. Definitely give a thumbs up to this video to help me out. You can click the bell for notifications for when I upload the next video that I already recorded that should have been up already, but it's not. And again, like I said, whoever has the best comment about what one of my costumes looked like, you'll be the winner. I really don't know what you're about to win. Sorry, I couldn't tell you. You can drop your cash app down below. I might request some money from you. I don't know, but we're going to figure it out. Now, I did have fun making this video. It was a lot of fun. YouTube is a lot, though. Changing all these outfits, makeup, hair, all that is too much. It's a lot. But I did have fun. So I hope you guys enjoy watching.